away, take it away, feeling too good to me. What's up, y'all? Welcome back to another vlog with your girl, Leje Monique. If you're new, welcome to my channel. If you're not new, welcome back. So, today is Tuesday, May 14th. I'm pretty sure it's May 14th. It's gonna be on the screen <laughs> if, 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 if I'm incorrect. But anywho, it is 2.38 p.m. The reason why I'm starting this vlog so late in the day is because I was going back and forth about doing another vlog. Um, but here we are. Here we are. So today, this morning, I got up, took Aiden to school, did my prayer time, did my Bible study, ended up opening up packages that have been sitting in my room. I did end up getting Katoya her gifts today. I had her come over um, earlier. She ate lunch with us. It was great, great, great. And also, husband and I had a sit down with our pastor and his wife. Like, we are really locked in with our pastor and his wife. Like, we'd be going out to eat and things like that. And I feel like it is so important, y'all. It's so important to have people in your corner, people that you can learn from. Because at the end of the day, you do not know everything. I don't know everything, German, everything. And it's just that on that. Like, I like soaking up the wisdom and knowledge that I get from those two. And we were just talking about marriage and things like that. I will tell you, like, don't wait until your marriage is on the rocks or doing bad to try to seek counsel. I do advise you just to go talk to people, even when things are in bliss. You know what I'm saying? Like, anything that's going to keep y'all grounded and good. And I believe that getting wise counsel from a couple who's been married longer than you that can pour into your marriage is, ain't nothing wrong with that at all. And you don't have to just do it when things are going bad. Even when things are going to good, even when things are going good, we always want to be better, like individually and as a couple. So that talk was everything. I loved it so, so much. So many um, insights and notes we took down. Because me and Babe been together for seven years. We've been married for six. Um, six years. We had six years this past February. And it's a blessing because y'all know these days people barely be together. Make it to a year anniversary versus let alone six years of being together, being married. So it's truly a blessing. I thank God for my husband. I thank God for our union. And that's what it is. So now I'm headed to go pick up Aiden from the bus stop. We're going to head to Target afterwards because today is one of JJ's classmates birthday party and his mom ended up writing me last week and she was saying hey her name is Inez who the classmate one of one of JJ's one of JJ's little girlfriends girl that's a friend look not too much and she was like she really wants to invite him and also his brother so they're inviting Landon as well and one thing that hit me is crazy like so throughout the school year, like there's always birthday um, invitation cards in their backpack and stuff like that. Never took them to nobody's um, birthday party. And one thing I'm learning, and that's really my bad because I was such a introvert, like I told y'all, don't really like being around people, things like that. And I realized how much that messes with my kids, how much they can mess with your kids. like. Just because you're an introvert, you don't like being around people, do not let your kids suffer from that because of you and how you feel. So, the more I'm learning, you know what I'm saying, growing in parenthood, growing as a mom and things like that, I don't want my kids to be like that because as y'all see, I'm being intentional about not being like that no more because that's what the enemy wants, us to be isolated, us to not be around people. I, I, tell, I said this time and time again. And so, this is the first birthday party that, from a classmate that, I, that we're going to take, we're going to go and take him. So that's today at 5 p.m. And she had, it's the cutest thing. Because she sent me like an Amazon like wish list thing for the party. And I had JJ go through with me. And I was like, you know, you can pick her out some gifts. And on one of the um, one of the items on the gift list was a children's Bible. And he ended up picking that to give to her. So he picked that. He, baby, he ended up picking like eight things. I said, let's go ahead and scale that down to four. <laughs> four things, sir. Because you was hitting $200, $200 by then. So he picked four items and they all came in and um oh best friend called me right now. They all came in and so I got I need to go to Target to get a birthday like bag to put it in and get like a little card. So I'm gonna have Aiden go with me and then we'll go to the party uh this evening. So that's gonna be that. So yeah, I just wanna touch base with y'all, let y'all know what's up, let y'all know this is another vlog. Like your girl's on her Zoom. Okay, this is number three vlog that I've been uh, starting this month in May. So I feel like I'm doing good. Your girl's doing good. Okay, period. BRB. We here at Target. He wants some Starbucks. You get what? You get what? <laughs> you said you were going to waste my money. Well, Dan's called me. 
Yeah, somebody help me. You want that really? Yeah. This is what he wants. Bro, Dan keep calling me, y'all. I swear, he just called me. Hello. Getting on my nerves. Hi. How are y'all doing? Good, how are you? That's good. Can I get for you? I did the tall, um... Oh, what is it? Caramel Ribbon Crunch Can I fuck with you? Oh, you remember? <laughs> yeah. And then they tall, um... Strawberry frappuccino. Nice. No, that'd be all. Somebody help me. Hey, hey. See, it says painted. The, see, it says painted the dance. <sighs> Get your flip flop, Aiden. <laughs> Is it good? It tastes like coffee. It's not, it tastes like coffee. I don't, I don't understand why this wasn't mixed. Like, why would y'all put that gunk of strawberry at the bottom? And I'm hurt because I realized I didn't say it instead of almond milk. I knew I was writing the card. It tastes like coffee? You want mine? Yes, please. Thank you. I don't drink from other people. Just so. do it. Not, I'm your son. It don't matter. Not even my husband. I ain't drink from me. What you do? From John? I don't drink from him. No, I don't. It's tough. You like that? This juice is like coffee. What? It is giving straight coffee. I'm not even a coffee drinker like that, but it's all good, Pete. Not Ulta Beauty. We're going to get an Ulta over here. Like what? Okay, Target. I see what you want. Yes, I was a beauty up in Target, period. Are you loving it? <laughs> it's not better than vanilla. It's not better than vanilla. No. I just don't like how they got the trunk at the bottom. Did you get me washed? Did you get me washed? <laughs> 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 I know. She said, you didn't give me one? I said, you didn't give me <laughs> JJ said that she likes Mario, but I don't see Super Mario stuff over here. So, this is cute. She's turning six. It says six is smarter, six is braver, six is kinder, too. And since it's your six, but Ada Marcel. Gosh, Leo. You see what I gotta do? Oh, this one is number six too. He said my favorite color is red. I can't find what I want to find. Maybe this is cute though. I don't know. We're gonna see. Alright, so he said my favorite color is red. So we got the red bag and the red stuffing paper. And then that's the card I went with. So winner. This scent right here, this vanilla passion fruit, eats down. 10 out of 10 recommend. Next. Shopping with kids. They literally pick out all this. I came in for four things. This basket is filled. Yes, it is. It's over four things. Okay. That's fine. I can't stand. Ooh. I know what that is. What y'all looking at? <laughs> See what I'm saying? I'm doing the most. It's right like banana. No, it's bright. Oh my gosh. You getting a Honda for your first car or Hellcat. whatever you can afford. Hellcat. Why would you want a car set that's called Hellcat? It's just fast. Mm. If you can afford it, hey, it's all right. Mama, they're like 200,000. I ain't got that kind of money. You do too. You will. I see. I seen that. I know. I know. I will. I seen that Chase account. Let me get off this thing. <laughs> Taste one. That's a thing. Tic tac. I told him it probably tastes like flat Sprite. If it's Sprite flavor, I'm pretty sure it tastes like no fizzy. One. Here. Oh my gosh. You know what? I'm tired of you. I'm tired of this. Yeah, you don't got taste one. That's all right. Y'all want to see him get smashed, y'all? Cause that's when the gentle parents are going Stop! Stop! <laughs> that's 
some stink. Oh my gosh, you shouldn't you open it. <laughs> oh my, don't you smell that? Chili cheese. Oh my gosh, ew. Are you ready? You got the gift? To my side, JJ, where? Hi! I got Lucky's dad. I can, I can, I will, I must. I don't care how hard it is. I don't care how difficult it is. I can. Queen in the building. That's how he has shit. Facts. He says Queen on the way up. She don't know that she's still looking. What's up, Queen? Queen in the building. Hell to the queen. <laughs> Did you see how we both could get it? Like your shoes yeah, and then go back that. up or something like that. They'll do it like that. Ooh, you must be serious. I know. Too. Five. All right. Here we Four. Go. Three. Let's see. Oh. 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 Get your girl what you oh. need out here. And then it's giving done for the day. <laughs> you already done. She already done. I don't even drain no more. Facts. Look at that. Now I'm over here trying to. Uh, no, you said, wait a minute. Piece my life together. Uh. <laughs> oh my God. I'm going to start a YouTube channel at 100 to 10K. All right, just keep y'all updated. So I ended up starting a compound plan, starting with 600 bucks. Um, today was my first day. I hit the goal. I actually made a little bit more than what I was supposed to make. And this compound plan is supposed to give me 239K by June 25th. We're going to see. I'm really trying to practice the art of self-control and discipline. And really, once I make the profit, just get out. Don't overtrade. Don't, because that's when blowing my account be popping up. Cause I'm out here over trading, doing the most, trying to get more. Like so, no. So I'm really trying to 
create the art of having discipline and self-control like i'm telling y'all even though i've been doing this for like a little minute now like i still have battled with that and i feel like i know how to trade so good i start feeling too good so i feel like i can't lose and then i end up losing so we're gonna see how this go i want to start off with something small 600 dollars not too much and see if i can grow because my husband grew 200 dollars. what was that babe 205,000. he grew 200 dollars. Okay, well, two hundred dollars, eleven thousand, and that motivated the heck out of me. Like, you do not need a lot of money to trade. Like, I used to think that, oh, I need a thousand, oh, I need five thousand to start. You don't. You really don't. It has nothing to do with the amount you start with. It's all about the skill, having that discipline, having that self control, having your daily goal, sticking to that goal, and being done. Not trying to press it and do more. So, that's where your girl is at. All right, y'all. So as y'all saw, I got my early workout in. Um, Took Aiden to school, did my Bible study, made some breakfast, all the things y'all know the normal, normal. So, anywho, it's almost 10 a.m. and I'm about to drive to Dave's house. So, she set up like this little brunch type vibe for me, her and Toya. And I'm excited because what? Like, equally yoked friendships are important. I need y'all to know that. Like, equally yoked friendships are chef's kiss. And when it comes to day, like, it's just crazy because I'm very, very, if I'm being honest, I'm very critical when it comes to, like, women that I let, who I let close to me. Only because just in the past of, like, people wanting to get close to me um, from what they can gain or secretly jealous or whatever the case may be. So, I'm very, very critical about who I let in my space. Like, I'll say hi to people, have a conversation, but as far as, like, my core people, like, I'm very, very intentional about who is in my core and meeting day it's like i instantly just knew like off her spirit her energy it was like god said yep she come on into the group and y'all have no idea how long i used to pray for god to send me godly friends like that's something i used to battle with a lot but now i'm just so blessed to be blessed with i have three women in my life who are my core people them is my girls like those are my girls period my girls but anyway, anyhow, so headed there, and then after that, I'm going to go home, probably change, because I want to get my toes done, okay? I'm going to get my toes done, I want to go to Party City to get nice and balloons, tomorrow's her graduation, and Jeremy's going to get the flowers, I'm going to get the balloons, and we'll bring it tomorrow, and then, I ended up hitting on my trainer, because I forgot to tell her about her graduation tomorrow at 9.30, and I'm like, I'm supposed to work at 7.30, and I'm not trying, I'm not trying to be like rushing around, trying to get back home, getting a shower, things like that. And I said, do you have any other time available? Since so I said 5 a.m. And I'm like, 5 a.m.? Oh, my goodness. And it literally took me like an hour and a half to write her back because I had to, like, really just ponder and think about it, you know. But I told her I'll take it. So, 5 a.m. Gym, gym sesh tomorrow morning, which means I'm going to bed early tonight, okay? Because I don't play with my sleep. Like, I need the beauty rest. That's just really what it is. But, anywho my outfit look at the color y'all so it's like um these little flowy pants and like this top she wanted us to wear kind of like lounge slash pajama type wear and i ordered i ordered this off amazon y'all and it eats down like i love it so much i feel like this is something that you can dress down and dress up but the color is chef's kiss like the color is really good it's giving summer's almost here that's what it's giving here now here with the girls with the here girls now. look I told you again in my head about me being extra. It was. <laughs> Period. If you know, you know. If you know, you're going to find out. <laughs> Look how cute, y'all. Is that Chick fil A? Yep. Toy, I know you hype. It is. Look how cute this is. Oh my gosh. I love it. Yeah, I'm ready to go to bed. Like, I am so tired, and I don't know why. I don't know why I feel like this, but anyway, anyhow, it's 1 p.m. We spent a couple hours at days, and that was a time well spent. We had a great, great, great girl time. I love them girls to death. Um, ended up going back home and getting me some lunch because your girl be hungry. You should be hungry. So, got me some lunch, and then. 
it took everything in me not to just stay in my bed and the bed, like for real. But well, glory be, glory be. I just gonna get my toes done because they need to be done real bad. I'm not gonna have time. I can't go get them done tomorrow, but I feel like if I'm wearing open toe to Nye's graduation tomorrow, I want my toes to be done. So, and it needs to be done. That's just really what it is. So I'm gonna do that, and then I'm gonna go ahead. I'm gonna go ahead and head to Party City and get a couple of balloons for Nye, like I told you guys, and then I'll be able to come back home. Okay, I'm gonna do the zoo. Well, I'm kind of iffy on the balloons because, like, I know I'm gonna get them, but I'm like, I'm trying to see if I'm trying to place an order and be able just to come get them later on today, like this evening. Have Jarwell get them? Um, because I don't think they open early enough for me to get them in the morning. Congratulations at 9 30. So, we're gonna see though. We're gonna see. All right, y'all. So, it's Thursday. I'm in shambles this morning. So, I'm gonna say I have some. So, I know I did not record yesterday when i was at the actual nail salon but i was just tired y'all and also i did just start editing um the weekend vlog that i'm gonna end up putting out whenever i put it out but i did majority of the editing while i was at the nail salon <laughs> yesterday for a different vlog that i'm about to put out but it's 7 40 a.m y'all i told y'all we have nice graduation today at 9 30 okay so i was supposed to work out at 5 a.m this morning and we ended up having this random thunderstorm at 12 minutes. Like, I've never had a storm, like, wake me up wake me up in my sleep. And it, like, woke me up. And we had to turn on the news and see if there was any tornado warning. So, that was crazy. Tried to go back to sleep a little bit. And then at 3-something, I ended up texting my trainer saying, hey, I'm no good when I got no sleep. You know what I'm saying? I'm no good when I ain't got no sleep. So, I told her, I said, um, I'm going to just have to take an L. And she was like, oh, you can come this afternoon. You know, you can come at 2. And I said, okay, I'll do that. I'll come at 2. So, I'm going to go work out today at 2. Um, but you guys a little sleepy. But glory be to God that I am awake. Me and husband are up. I need to go soon. I'm about to work to this graduation. Um, and I need to do my Bible study, y'all. But, it's like, the time is time is so much. Like, it just it's already 740. And we need to be leaving here at about 8. 30 8 45 so we can stop and get her flowers and then head over there like her school is like 30 minutes away from where we live at anyway so <sighs> y'all it's, it's already been a day but glory be to god it's very gloomy it's rainy outside right now but it's okay we're gonna make it do what to do so i'll touch base back with y'all when i get in the car brb i just want to get on here and tell y'all real quick so my count is at 12 47 i ended up making 455 today in the markets I'm supposed to be at 792 on a compound for today. On a compound plan for today, I'm supposed to be at 792 and I'm at 1200. Glory be to God, that was not planned, but I'll take it. And um, I like when I'm ahead of the compound plan because I can really just take my time with it. Like I said yesterday, I'm really trying to practice the art of self-control and discipline. Um, Cause like I said, uh, having a good skill like this don't mean nothing if you can't be disciplined and have that self-control and don't let greed try to overtake you. So, yeah, I'm excited and I just love it because my prayer now is that God just changed my desires. And one of my desires is like once I make profit, once I make profit in the market, I don't want to have the desire to want to keep trading or get back in there. And I've been doing really good. Like once I made profit today, I'm just done. I don't have a desire to get back in there. I made the profit over the profit and I'm good. So we're going to see how this goes, y'all, because if I can finish this thing out, like it's 39K, like, oh. All right, y'all, a little fit check. It's a nice little cute little jumpsuit with my heels. And we're ready to go see baby girl graduate, period. So let's go. All right, in the car, headed to Homeland to get nice some flowers. Bessie said that Homeland has the best flowers. She showed me her roses. And she's been having it for two weeks. Like, girl, what? So we here. They said he wants to just bring me to the front so I can run in, get some roses, get him some gum, and come back to the car instead of running. So hopefully he does the same thing at the school. Drive me off. Alright. Cause your girl's too cute. Locks or not, I don't wanna get wet. It's just with these. But yeah, BRB. Alright, so I'm supposed to be in here for some flowers, but I'm over here looking at this stuff. Look at this. She loves candy too. I might get this. And they got the balloons, y'all. So I gotta be working on my paper. Drive me gonna be like, why are you bringing other stuff to the car? <laughs> All right, y'all, so of course I'm guys' favorite. <laughs> Ended up still getting her a balloon, and look at these flowers. It has like the little, um, the hat and the tassel on the flowers. Y'all, she gonna love it. I'm excited! 
This rain ain't gonna stop no show here. Right. Here. sweating like this like what i was just dolled up and cute now i'm out here sweaty from a workout but it was good come at two o'clock ain't too bad y'all but i cannot swap it out for my morning because i just love a good morning routine my bible study my prayer time a good workout getting active like chef's kiss but anywho 2 33 i'm about to go ahead to get in from the bus stop i text him i asked him that he won't go on a jog with me because normally i think i mentioned this after my upper body day um, I would do the treadmill for like 20 minutes or like till I get to a mile, whichever one comes first. And I didn't have enough time to do it today, only 30 minutes. So just did like a little bit of jump rope, but I asked Aiden did he want to go for a jog slash a walk with me on the lake. And he said yeah, so I'm gonna go pick him up, go back home, get him some tennis shoes, get his little weighted vest he made me buy him because he trying to get active out y'all. And I may end up bringing Max too because he likes going out, for, uh, out to the lake, so BRB. Why is he moving so slow to get out this car? Kids. Mm, mm, mm. Meanwhile, I'm ready to go. Ooh, let me back on up. The girl out here ready to go. It's giving track body, period. Period. Y'all, we out here. You see he way up there? He tried to start running. I said, what happened to the job, P? What happened to a nice job? Oh yeah, let's get it. 